All right, welcome everybody. It's KB here. So one of the biggest update for Windows 11 that we have been waiting for a very long time now is here. Yes, Android apps on Windows 11 is now available. So they call it a Android subsystem for Windows, just like we have uh, Linux sus subsystem for Windows. So it's the same thing. It's going to work the same way as you use the Linux. So that's that. So in this video, I'm just going to show you guys how to get it right now because uh, this is not available for everyone. Okay. Right now, this feature is only available to Windows Insiders and Beta Channel, not even to the Dev Channel. I don't know why, but Beta Channel is getting the first treatment here. Yay! Good thing, because Beta Channel is much stable than the Dev Channel. And just to make this video, I switched to the beta channel and uh, yeah let me show you how to get it right now okay first of all uh, before i start uh, make sure that your pc is compatible with windows 11 if you have somehow installed a windows 11 even if your pc wasn't compatible then uh, this feature might not work okay that's the first thing and second thing you need to join the insider program and uh, you need to select the beta channel uh, to join the insider program go to windows updates all right once you are in windows updates go to windows insider program and in here you will see a join button uh, you need to link your microsoft account to it and then you'll have the option to choose or it will ask itself which channel you want to choose and choose beta channel and it is also recommended because it's stable than the dev channel and uh, android subsystem for windows is only available to beta channel users as of now and yeah that's the first thing you need to do and another thing is that you need to set your region to united states so let's say you live in another country let's say canada or any anywhere in the world beside usa okay uh, you need to go to the settings uh, let me show you region settings yeah so in region settings make sure that your country or region is united states otherwise you won't be able to use this feature okay so that's that and once you have done all of that update your pc you will get a beta update and after that update your uh, microsoft store okay you'll get a update just go to the library and after that click on get updates and you'll get all the uh, updates that is available for windows 11 beta and you'll also get a microsoft uh, store update uh, let me show you here actually so make sure that you have this version of the microsoft store to use this so this is the actually i will also put link in the description for the documentation for this android subsystem for windows 11 there you will see all the requirements and everything okay you don't have to watch this video but if you enjoy watching video then watch the video good thing okay i will put link in the description for that documentation anyway okay so i'm talking the same thing that the, the documentation said and now i'm using the android apps on windows 11 that's that <laughs> okay so make sure that you have updated your microsoft store and it is this version all right once you have updated just search here amazon amazon app store you can search that you'll find that and you can see i have already installed it it has option to open so once you download this open this and start installing the android apps on your windows 11 um, almost like native performance as far as i can tell it, it is working very well okay but the problem here is that Okay, I think you understand everything. Okay, make sure that your PC is compatible with Windows 11. Okay, and all that. And uh, you'll be good to go. You'll get this. So that's that. But the problem here is that there are only few apps. Mostly there are only games actually. Okay. Uh, even if you go to the all apps section, you'll see only games. These are the only games that are available. There are not... 
uh, all Android apps or anything like that. So I have downloaded the Coin Master, I believe. Yeah, 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 yeah. So you can see this is the Coin Master uh, Android app. But you know, you can work around and install a um, other app store or you can also sideload a application yeah that's a thing okay so i have done that uh, you can see i have downloaded the fdroid um, aurora store uh, which i i'll show you actually okay so i'm gonna make it a separate video for how to sideload a android apps on uh, windows 11 okay uh, i did it there are a few tutorials on internet actually already so there is uh, as of now one tutorial i, I believe uh, i'm gonna make the same tutorial okay so from here you can actually download the some more android applications so this is a third party uh, app store for android actually if you don't know uh, let me just download this just to show you guys okay um, but uh, for now as of now uh as you can tell amazon app store is useless because there are some kids games maybe some cool game like a west game yeah well maybe uh grown-ups can play that but yeah uh, amazon store right now is very limited uh that's all i want to say okay uh, and i get it it's an early preview build maybe in future it will get better maybe in future you know people will figure out how to install a google play store and all that and one more thing if you somehow install or sideload a any application that requires you to have a google services and uh, and all that you know uh, that won't work because this doesn't have a google services installed so yeah i'm i'm actually trying to install a google play services i failed i tried twice and still uh, yeah it's 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 uh, it's gonna take some time to make everything work properly <laughs> so you can see we installed color note application from the uh, aurora store and it is working yay we don't have to use the <laughs> amazon app store actually that's a thing right <laughs> but you want to use it officially yeah that is the official app store for windows 11 android subsystem amazon app store which is as of now is garbage okay uh, it doesn't have anything at all but uh, uh, i side loaded the aurora store which is somewhat of a google play store and uh, yeah so let me actually show you YouTube. I'm going to install the YouTube application and YouTube application requires you to have a Google services and all that. So uh, this might not work. Okay. So come on, let me hit the install button. Oh, okay. It installed. Okay. YouTube. This won't work, I think. Yeah, because uh, this doesn't have any play services, Google Play services and all that. Actually, I'm going to try to install those, as I said. <laughs> First, I need to make a, a tutorial on how to sideload a Android apps on Windows 11. First, that's going to be next video. Right after this, I'm going to make that video. Okay, so you can see YouTube didn't work because obviously uh, we don't have the uh, Google Play services and all that. But the apps that doesn't require you to have a Google Play services and all that, you can use them. So for some reason, uh, uh, everything is gone. They are stuck. Oh, they are not stuck. Okay, I closed them out. So that's it. Hope you enjoyed it. And this is how you get a Android subsystem for uh, Windows 11 and this is how you run the Android apps on Windows 11 all right and uh, sometimes it can be buggy you know uh, I think I crashed the Android subsystem by downloading the YouTube application because it requires you to have a Google Play Store and all that so the Android subsystem will not open you'll have to restart your PC or you know you'll get this kind of thing here let me show you this is uh, the Android subsystem settings okay from here you can open the files and all that but i have broken the uh 
Android subsystem by downloading the YouTube application again. Okay. So you can actually turn off the Android subsystem from clicking on this turn off button. All right. And uh, if it does not, then you'll have to restart. So it's an early build, so we can't complain much about it. But that's it. Hope you enjoyed it. And um, yeah, uh, I'm going to make a next video about how to sideload the application. All right. That's it. Hope you enjoyed it. I will see you in the next one. Take care of yourself and have fun. And uh, I will also put a link in the description for the Android subsystem documentation by the Microsoft. So you can go there and read all the things that you need to use this feature. All right. That's it. I will see you in the next one. Take care of yourself and have fun. Bye. -bye.